Okay, so today I have a review on I forgot the brand name, but this is a pirate blood blaster. Let's just say by Double Strike. I don't know. That's not the name of the brand, but you know what I mean. M Marty had a breath. <laughs> Need to stop for a little bit. Um, so this is a single shot. Oh, it's by Busby. It's by Busby. Um, the pirate blood blaster. I don't know. Um, but this blaster is a very awful, awful blast blaster. Um, to go over it at the front, there's no connector thing thingy up here because it's a single thing. And then all this plastic here is not, not, not doing much than here. It's actually the priming handle to prime you pull back on, on it like that. That does not look er ergonomic. It's because it's not. It is absolutely the most annoying thing to prime this because you point and then you have to pull back like that which when you are and it takes a ridiculous amount of strength to pull back um I'll get into why that's so ridiculous in my opinion um the trigger pull feels really weird there's barely any like length there you can see but that's like the fully like out and then that's the fully like depressed so it's a very weird like trick you're going to take some weight to to pull all the way back. Um and the gr gr grip is curved, it's small, it's uncomfortable. It feels very like forward and odd. Um and you do have a little bit of a bit of gold plastic air at the bottom just for for, for, for looks cuz people in the pirate days, they fire off a shot and then they like let the the barrel like cool off or they wouldn't I don't know, I know what they do. And then they take this and then they just bonk, bonk them on the head. That's why there's usually some metal there. Um, so to op op operate, you front load. You just shove a duck dart in there. And as you can see, it sticks out a ridiculous amount. You pull back on the handle. You point, And you pew, pew. Um, um, this is overall a absolutely awful blaster. Um, it fires once. Um... And if I had to guess, I would say the chrono is probably like 35 or lower. Um, as you can probably hear, I have my take down here. So, here. Here we have the Busby uh, pirate gun and then the takedown, okay? The Nerf rival takedown. Standing from the other side of the bed, I will be aiming and then shooting, okay? So. The pirate blood app blaster for first. Now the takedown. It was prime. So you can hear the difference in the shot. The pirate blood app blaster um doesn't even hurt to get sh shot by. You get shot by the takedown and you're f f f feeling that in the next week. But you get shot by the pirate gun, gun, gun and you don't even know. <laughs> Um, this blaster truly is awful. The trigger pull is awful. The grip is awful. The ergonomics are awful. Um, I mean, it's a good, it's a good prop, prop. Like if you want to like store it in there, then you're just like, yeah, I'm a pot pi pi pirate. You know, like you can like front load that. <laughs> you you can you know like front load how they do. They take like a take like a little like peg thing, take it and they like shove it down the barrel. Like drop their powder in, and they take their cotton ball, they shove it in there, take out the little rod, they push it in, and then they pull back on the thing, and they just let one fly. Um, so, overall, good prop, but horrible actual blood blaster. It shoots super weak, it is not comfortable to use, and this just, because of the awful angle it's at, it requires a lot of strength, and then that, that can happen too. As you can see, my hand is nowhere near the, the uh, trigger. If I pull it back and just let, let it fly, it'll actually shoot the blaster. So here. Uh, you can't make that uh, add that up. Um, why does this exist? I mean, again, it's a good prop. But other than that, there's no reason for this to exist. It's awful to prime. They totally could have just done, like, a different style of prime. You have to pull that back on that, which is just awful. It The trigger pull is awful. awful. The grip is awful. 
I mean, it is a cool prop. Again, okay, I'm starting to repeat myself. I mean, this video has been drawn out long enough. So yeah, my review on the pirate on the Busby toys, Pi pirate lap blaster. Um, cool idea, but just awful execution. Um, they totally just could have made it like um, have an internal ma magazine. Could have bul bulked it up a little, little bit. It probably could have added in more er ergonomic prime, um, better handle, more the solid trigger pull, and just better ergonomics. Um, so yeah. Just don't buy this, okay? Just don't.